So we have a list of eight consecutive integers, and if we add four to every one of them, that will generate four new numbers. Why would it generate four new numbers? Well, the lower four numbers in the original set, adding four to each of those would just give us numbers that are already in that set. But adding four to the four larger numbers in the original set will generate new numbers, four new numbers to be exact. Now, exactly the same thing will happen on the other side of the set when we subtract four from every number in the original set. The largest four numbers in the original set will just generate the lower four numbers in the original set when we subtract four from each one, but we will generate four new numbers to the left of the set. The four lower numbers in the original set will uh, generate four new lower numbers when we subtract four from each one of those. So in the end of the day, when they ask how many more numbers will the new set have compared to the original set, well, it will be four new numbers in the top and four new numbers in the bottom for a total of eight. If you found this video useful, go to quantreasoning.com for a lot more where that came from. You should also click that like button and let me know in the comments below what you'd like me to make future videos about. And of course, if you haven't yet subscribed, go ahead and do that and click that bell below so you get notified about future videos. See you next time.